Okay, finger tap to start with. So, we just continue on from last one. Palmy things this time. Here we go with the first one. takes I need in order to play this wacky thing. So, here we go. One, two, three, four, and, and a three, up, uh, and one, up, uh, and three, and a four, and up, uh, and two, and three, and four, up, uh, one. Goodness, let me try that again. Hang on. You might want to do that when going from bar three to bar four. So you got your four, uh, one, uh, two, and, uh, and uh, four. And, uh, so you got that little bit of a swing there at the end. You got the swing feel at the end of bar three and the beginning of bar four. So you got four, uh, one, uh, two, and, uh, and uh, four. And, uh. All right. Let's see if I can get this on take two. One, two, three. Four and a two and a three up and one up and three and a four and a and two and three and four uh, one a two and a and a four and a and a and a three up and one up and three and a four and a and two and Four. 
Look at that. Two takes, I got it. This last thing <clears throat> is to make sure you're able to switch between straight eighth notes, triplets, and sixteenth notes. I'm going to put a metronome on. This is going to have to be practiced with a metronome. You have to do it. Because if you don't, then you have... It's going to be too easy to not have a consistent strum pattern. So, yes, metronome has to be used for this. And... There. So hopefully that will be loud enough. There we go. One... Two, three, four. One, and two, and three, and four, and 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 So let's see if you can figure that part out by ear. You can play it next week. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. All right, let me know if you got any questions. I will see you again Saturday.